Hey there, nature enthusiasts! Welcome to our special celebration of the International Day for Biological Diversity 2025. Today, we're diving deep into the wonders of our natural world and exploring how we can live in harmony with nature while promoting sustainable development. It's International Day for Biological Diversity 2025, and this year's theme is Harmony with Nature and Sustainable Development. This theme is more than just a slogan. It's a call to action for every one of us to recognize the intricate connections between our lives and the natural world. From the air we breathe to the food we eat, biodiversity plays a crucial role in sustaining life on Earth. So, let's dive into why this day matters and how it's connected to our future. Biodiversity is the foundation of ecosystem services that are essential to human well-being. It supports everything from food security to health, clean water, and climate resilience. Without it, our very survival is at risk. First off, did you know that 2025 is a crucial year? This year marks a significant milestone in our global efforts to protect and restore biodiversity. It's a pivotal moment where we must assess our progress and ramp up our actions to meet the ambitious targets set for the coming years. We're only five years away from hitting the targets set by both the Global Biodiversity Framework and the Sustainable Development Goals. These targets are designed to address the most pressing environmental challenges of our time, from habitat loss and climate change to pollution and over-exploitation of natural resources. These plans are like two sides of the same coin, aimed at halting and reversing nature loss within the next 25 years. By integrating biodiversity considerations into all aspects of development, we can create a more sustainable and resilient future for all. The Kunming Montreal Global Biodiversity Framework sets 23 targets for 2030. These targets include ambitious goals such as protecting 30% of the planet's land and sea areas, reducing pollution from plastics and excess nutrients, and ensuring that biodiversity is used sustainably. For instance, it aims to restore 20% of degraded ecosystems and cut invasive species by half. Why? Because healthy ecosystems are vital for our survival. They provide us with clean air and water, fertile soils, and a stable climate. Restoring degraded ecosystems can also help mitigate climate change by sequestering carbon and enhancing biodiversity. Because losing biodiversity means we're also undermining 80% of the targets of eight SDGs. That's a big deal. The Sustainable Development Goals are interconnected and biodiversity is a key component in achieving many of them, including those related to poverty, hunger, health, water, and climate action. Human actions have altered 75% of our land and 66% of our marine environments. Shocking, right? These changes have profound impacts on the ecosystems that support life on Earth. Deforestation, pollution, and overfishing are just a few examples of how human activities are driving biodiversity loss at an unprecedented rate. 1 million animal and plant species are facing extinction. This alarming statistic highlights the urgent need for action. Each species plays a unique role in its ecosystem, and the loss of even one can have cascading effects on the entire system. This loss also opens the door for more zoonoses, or animal-to-human diseases. When natural habitats are destroyed, wildlife comes into closer contact with humans, increasing the risk of disease transmission. Protecting biodiversity is not just about preserving nature, it's also about safeguarding human health. Biodiversity is crucial for our survival. It underpins the functioning of ecosystems that provide us with essential services. From regulating the climate to purifying water and pollinating crops, biodiversity is the backbone of life on Earth. It provides us with water, food, medicine, clothing, fuel, shelter, and energy. These resources are the building blocks of our daily lives. Without them, we would struggle to meet our basic needs and maintain our quality of life. In fact, fish supply 20% of animal protein for around 3 billion people, and plants make up over 80% of our diet. This highlights the importance of sustainable fishing and agriculture practices to ensure that these resources are available for future generations. Plus, about 80% of rural populations in developing countries rely on traditional plant-based medicine. These natural remedies are often the only source of healthcare for many communities, making the conservation of medicinal plants a priority. So, what can we do? Each of us has a role to play in protecting biodiversity. Simple actions like reducing waste, 
supporting sustainable products and participating in local conservation efforts can make a big difference. The UN urges us to respect, protect and repair our biological wealth. This means taking proactive steps to conserve natural habitats, restore degraded ecosystems and promote sustainable use of natural resources. It's not just about saving species, it's about saving ourselves. Our well-being is intrinsically linked to the health of our planet. By protecting biodiversity, we are ensuring a sustainable and prosperous future for all. Dive deeper into this topic by visiting the Convention on Biological Diversity website. There, you can find more information on global efforts to protect biodiversity and how you can get involved. And remember, harmony with nature is harmony with life. By living in balance with the natural world, we can create a healthier, more sustainable future for ourselves and generations to come. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more content like this. See you next time. Together we can make a difference and celebrate the beauty and importance of biodiversity every day.